Wednesday, y'all. Happy Wednesday. <laughs> I go back to work today. Um, it's about 12 o'clock. Uh, I got up earlier and uh, laid back down. And now I'm getting ready. So I decided to turn on the camera and uh, just share my feelings as I'm going back to work. As you guys know, I've been off for two weeks um, because I had COVID-19. Well, I'm headed back to work today. Yes, it, my leave ended September 1st, which was yesterday. But my work schedule is Wednesday through Saturday. So I go back today, which is the second. And I have to be to work um, at 3, but I'm going in a little early, about 2 o'clock because... I'm going to check emails, you know, just follow up. Plus, I haven't had any overtime in two weeks. So, I'm just going to go in a little earlier, get back acclimated, get back into the swing of things. And, um, yeah, I'm kind of excited about going back to work. Um, Y'all know I like to keep busy. I like to keep moving, stay busy. So, you know, it is what it is. It just feels strange. I've been home. It's been like, you know, old times. Be, you know, minus the work because I haven't been actually working. Not not on my job anyway. Um, So it, it felt like old times. It felt like where I was supposed to be. So it does feel a little strange going back to work today, but hey, it is what it is. It's time to get back into the groove. I'm sure a lot of things have been changing and moving. So I need to go back and get acclimated, get ready for our peak season. Um, Amazon's peak season starts um, around Thanksgiving and it goes on through the 1st of January. That's when just like any other store, we're busy, super, super, super busy um, with people ordering for Thanksgiving and Christmas and New Year's and stuff like that. So as we amp up for peak, I know it's time to just get back into the swing of things. So it is what it is. I'm going to go ahead and get ready and um, yeah, get back to it. <laughs> I'm feeling a little strange. I did have a good morning though. I got up earlier and I met our field ministry, our field service group. I didn't go out. Okay. So I feel like I'm saying it wrong because you'll think that we're actually going out. So Jehovah Witnesses go out in the ministry often. And um before we go out, we organize, um, we get organized in what's called a field service or field ministry group and so the group is to to uh organize where we'll be what area we'll be in the ministry who we'll work with and also get spiritual encouragement by means of the bible and then they say a prayer at the end well ever since COVID 19 ever since um this pandemic we haven't even had our worship service at the Kingdom Hall. Everything has been done on Zoom. So we do have a group that meets certain days of the week um, for the ministry group. And if you want to stay on the call, we do letter writing and calls um, on Zoom. So I did, I didn't um, participate in the ministry this morning, but I did meet the group because it's very encouraging. I, I met the group Monday also and spent two hours in the ministry and that was wonderful and I'm going to miss it, but um, hopefully I can get back to it soon or invest more time in it soon. So I met the group this morning, got encouraged. I did my Bible reading, read the daily text this morning, uh, had breakfast, had a hot cup of coffee, had a hot cup of ginger root tea. And then I laid down about 11.30 for about 30 or 45 minutes. Not really with the goal of sleeping, just wanted to rest before I had to get up and get moving. So now I'm waiting the 10 minutes before I take this mask off. As you can see, it's almost dry. It's dry around here, but 
where it's dark and kind of wet looking, that's where it's still wet. You can tell the difference between where it's dry and where it's wet. So I feel my face getting tight. It feels good. I almost dyed my hair last night, but I changed my mind because we have our Tuesday night meeting um, with the congregation and it just wasn't enough time. But I am going to lighten my hair. I have, if you haven't seen in a, another video, I have another color. I'm going to take it up just a little lighter. This is the color that I have. It's light caramel brown. And I'm super excited because this is the color that I wanted before I did this. Now, I do like this. But I think I'm going to like this even more. So I'm going to do that soon. When I do it, I'll probably do it um, on video so I can share the experience and how it turns out with you. I need to take out. I used the last of my body wash, so I got a new one. Um, I'm going to put in the in the shower for my shower tonight. This one is called Lavender, Relaxing Lavender Oil and Chamomile. So I haven't tried this one, um, but I just finished up this one and it was amazing. I'm gonna have to get this one again. Sensitive Micellar Water. If these two are on Amazon, I'll put the link below. This one smells so fresh and clean and it makes your body feel amazing. I had never used this one. My mom actually picked some of these up for me um, when she was shopping. And she got me a whole bunch of ones that we had never seen before. Sensitive, it's for sensitive skin. It's called Sensitive Micellar Water. 0% sulfate, soap, S-L-E-S, soap free. Ultra gentle cleansing for sensitive skin. This one was awesome. So if I go back and buy some more, when I'm finished, I have like five or six containers of these. When I get low, I'm definitely going to be getting some more of these. Wonderful. But anyway, I'm not going to walk away on you. I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and get dressed. I don't want the time to get away from me because I'm going to stop and get my coffee on the way and possibly pick up a salad or something for lunch. I gained five pounds, y'all. Five pounds because I'm sitting around and not moving. So that if that is the only reason that I'm happy to go back to work, let it be the reason. Movement keeps your weight down. So um, let me get dressed and I'll see you in the car. All right, I'm ready to go. Let me turn this up so you can see me. I'm ready to go. I just wanted to show you what I'm wearing. Got on some black um, Dickie work pants. Got on the shirt, one of the shirts from my site our Amazon site and making it sound three. Our motto is where grit meets soul. Wearing my, everybody has to wear a vest. I'm wearing my human resources vest. I got on my orange and white um, Air Maxes. And I have two masks in my purse. I think tonight, I'm going to try the one that I really like. So this is the standard mask that Amazon gives. Right? But this is like my favorite mask. And it gives me more coverage. So I'm taking both of them. I'm going to try them and see. But right now I'm getting ready to walk out the door. I'm going to order my coffee. Um, stop and get gas. And then get coffee. So I'll see you in the car. Concrete walls, there's a place for us Where we could go, where we could be alone Between city lights, we don't have to hide I wanna go, do you wanna follow? There's something in the air, I can't explain it but it's there Ain't nobody gonna find us in our secret love affair I don't wanna have to hide no more, it shouldn't be a fair Yesterday, 
my first day back at work and I had so many phone calls on the way to work that I didn't get a chance to turn the camera in and talk to you on the way to work. So today is day two. I'm headed into work. And um, last night wasn't bad, you guys. I walked back in. Everybody was happy to see me. Everybody noticed that I hadn't been there. So that was really nice for everybody to welcome me back. And um, it was an easy night. The night went by fast um, with minimal issues. I had a million um, things to get caught up on, but um, it went smoothly. So I'm happy about that. Today is day two thursday and i'm headed to work as a matter of fact i'm almost there um and then i work friday and i took saturday off and i've got something really nice planned i actually took saturday as a bereavement day my aunt passed away and i took advantage of the bereavement and took the bereavement but my husband and i are going to do something as a family to help me you know get past um how I'm feeling about losing my aunt uh, and everything like that. So we, um, he's off too and we're gonna do something as a family and I'm gonna take you guys with me and I'm super, super excited to do it because it's something that we've never done before and I think you're gonna enjoy being a part of it. Um, but anyway, um, it is 1.51. So I should get to work right at two o'clock I don't get off till two in the morning. I think you guys know that. Um, but um, I'm so happy for the overtime because I just got, well, I'll get it tomorrow, but I saw my pay stub yesterday. And there's a big difference between getting just the regular, see, I get shift dips and all kind of stuff for working the overnight shift and the weekend shift. And I, none of that comes when you're on leave of absence just get your straight however many hours and that is not the moves. <laughs> I'm happy for overtime and shift diff and weekend diff and all of that stuff. I mean, I'm appreciative. I, I don't make a bad salary but it's so much nicer when you have all of the extras that you're used to. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Um, I hope your day is filled with sunshine and um, I hope that at this moment you're enjoying life. Um, have a good day and I will talk to you guys soon. Talk to you later.